Hey guys, welcome back to Detroit Become Human. So the last time that we left off, um, is she looking at me? I don't know if I mentioned this, but uh, I like your interior decorating. It really reflects your personality. I mean, of course it does. This is creepy. I like it. But she likes it. She likes it, you guys. So the last time that we left off, we had just gone to Hank's house because Connor got a new objective to go search for some sort of deviant. He found Hank on the ground, had drank himself into basically a coma, and it looked like he had c attempted to commit suicide. We found out that his son had died, which is really, really sad. We don't know why. I'm assuming it has something to do with androids because he hates androids so much. Then with Marcus, we went and we got supplies for the Jericho. With Car and Alice, we escaped Zlatko's house. I think that's how you pronounce it. And it was crazy, you guys. Ever, like, there was polar bears, there were freaking androids, like Toy Story that had been like pieced together. It, it, that whole sequence was just so insane. But out of all of that, we had Luther join us, which I think is really cool. I'm, I'm interested to learn about him and what his personality is like. You guys were saying in the comment section that not a lot of people went through that sequence perfectly, so I'm interested to see what had actually taken place in that house if I had messed up or or had done something a little bit differently. But let's just get into it, guys. You guys were also saying that I look like Chloe. Do I? You look tired today. I hope you're doing okay. Oh yeah, we were going to a sex club. Oh, feels like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. You need water, Hank. You sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. Okay. I'm not excited about going into this place. Let's get going. All right, Connor. Software instability. So, let's go ahead and take a second. It says to follow Hank, but what about these other people? Like, can Sexiest I Sexiest androids in town. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. Wait. No, it doesn't want me to go that way. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, no, I don't like this. Wait! <laughs> oh no. No, no, no. Wrong one. Connor! The fuck are you doing? Coming, Lieutenant. Connor was just looking at a man. I'm sorry. But this girl. Oh, look, it's, it's, um, north. You're not gonna take my license, are you? I mean, okay. I had nothing to do with this. Yeah. Interesting. Um, so let's let's take a second. Is there anything else? No. We've got a lot of girls in what looks like a the sports bra. Ongoing, sir. I can't tell you anything for the moment. Hey, Hank. Hey, Ben. How's it going? It's that room there. Oh, uh, by the way, Gavin's in there too. Oh, great. Dead body and an asshole. Just what I needed. Okay. Lieutenant Anderson is plastic pet. Oh, what this guy. This guy. He's been assigned all cases involving androids. Oh yeah. Like wasting time. I tried to give There's you coffee. Who, uh, <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> we'll have a look anyway. If you don't. I mean, mind. not sticking up for well, the pervert, still. but. Uh, I still hate this guy. Of booze in here. Good night, Lieutenant. Oh. Okay. Investigate crime scene. Hold on. Examine victim. Examine. Yes. Okay. Let's start out with her. Stand up. Diagnose. Sure. Critically damaged. Yeah. Okay. 
She's dead, dead. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey! Oh, Connor, you're so disgusting. <laughs> I think I'm gonna puke again. Blue blood. Okay. That wasn't very much to examine. There really wasn't anything. But what's over here? Choose your fantasy. Oh, weird. Okay. There's a wallet here. Um, I guess we just should... We got booze. Little containers of hotel booze. I have no idea. Hank, you're blocking me! Hank! Get out the way. Cardiac arrest, no sign of cardiac event, heart attack, not cause of death. Okay. Looks like he overdosed. Um. Doesn't he? His eyes are bloodshot unless she strangled him. Because I'm not seeing any. Oh, any other areas. Severe bruising, she strangled him. Yep. I was about to say, there's. Not much else. Okay. She strangled him. Is there something here? No. He didn't die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah. I saw the bruising on the neck. Doesn't prove anything, though. Could have been a rough play. We're missing something here. Yeah. Think you can read the android's memory? I'm on Didn't it already. Reactivation required. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute. Maybe less. Oh, shoot. Okay. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. All right, let's do it. Her one. Oh God. <laughs> Explain, direct, soothe. You were damaged and I reacted to you. Everything is all right. Is he... Is he dead? Oh yeah, he's dead. Murderer facts. Tell me what happened. He started... hitting me. My rats are making noise. Again. And again. I... Did you kill him? No. Okay. No, it wasn't me. Um, Were you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted to play with two girls. I was about to say, if it wasn't That's her. That's he said there was two of us. Um, what model? Other android. Where did the other android go? Did it say anything? Fuck, I didn't get anything I should ask for the model. Well, we know that there's another one. So there was another android. Yeah. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. Ooh. Think you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place? Deviants aren't easily detected. I don't know. Oh shit. There's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness. Somebody who saw it leaving the room. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. Does this you place let me know if you think of anything. not have cameras in the lobby? Like, outside of this door? Did you know the victim? You wanna go talk to this girl? No, I mean, we came in maybe two, three times. I mean, he's... Wait, let's, let's, let's think. Find second android. Search for android eyewitnesses. Okay. Talk very much, you know? They come in, do their business, and they go on their way. Please try again. You ever have any trouble with androids before? Need human fingerprints. Oh, once. 
Um, we lost a model two, three months back. Uh, same model. Can I talk to this girl? Vanished. May I find out what happened? No, I'm gonna have to. Probably ask don't Kate. have any CCTV in there. Excuse me, Lieutenant. Can you come here a second? Found something? Maybe. Well, maybe we should look at them. Can we look at them? Should I be looking down the line of people? You know, for one that looks different than the others? Or was the game hinting at just that girl? So what if he wanted a guy? I mean, we don't know what that guy was into. We don't know his sexuality. Oh my god. The, the rats are going nuts. It's late. And this is when they start to really go crazy. Yeah, I'm not seeing any signs of, like, one versus another. So. Let's go ahead and ask the girl it pointed at. Which is this one. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor, we got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. Shoot, I didn't see any that looked any different. Hello. A 30 minute session costs $29.99. Please confirm your purchase. Okay. This is not gonna look good on my expense account. Purchase confirmed. I think I got the wrong girl. I didn't see anybody else, so. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? I think I got the wrong girl. We're just gonna probe her? That's kinda rough. Didn't it hurt? Oh shit. What the hell are you doing? Um, locate suspect. So I can't turn the camera, okay? Woo. So this guy goes in, okay. Oh! It's a girl with a ponytail. Blue haired Tracy headed toward the entrance. Is that it? Check next android. Okay. It saw something. What are you talking about? Saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue-haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Oh my god. R2. Last position. Was here. So we want to see this dude. Probably. Hey, what am I supposed to do with this one? Tell it you changed your mind. Uh, uh, Let's try this one. Yes. Better be for you didn't see anything? How is that possible? She went past the entrance. Suspect out of sight. Check another android. Shit. You didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This has got to be the most expensive investigation of my career. I thought this was the entrance. There she is. It turned back into the club. Okay. Connor. This way. I saw the blue haired Tracy. I know which way it went. Then go for it. What about there this girl? There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know it. Okay. There she is. Alright. Turn to the red room. Alright. In here. Go, 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 go. 
this dancing dude. Um, actually, I want you. Nothing. No. I lost its track again. I've spent all this money and I'm still not having fun. Um, let's try the dude next to you. I feel like the dancer wouldn't know. There she is! Okay. Turn to the blue room. Where the hell's the blue room? Oh, there it is. Okay. There she is. Okay. It hid in a room. Oh, I'm so nervous, you guys. This room. This room, this room, this room. It left the room. Person. I didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This has got to be the most expensive investigation of my career. Yes, the cleaning guy. For sure. Tell me. Tell me. Oh, that was her. Yep. It fled through the staff door. Okay. I know where it went. Follow me. Oh, fucking it. This Wait. is crazy. I'm really turned around, you guys. Was it this staff? Was it this room? Oh my god, no, it wasn't. Was it this staff door? I'm really turned around. Can I see him again, actually? Because... I have no idea. I guess we're going for it this way. I'm not really Wait. sure. I'll take it from here. What? There were two staff doors, though. I'm nervous. Search the warehouse. Do I have a time limit still? No. Okay, so I see stuff Shit. over there. We're too late. No. Who's this? This looks like her right here. On the table. Connor, can you walk? I don't think I can go over there. I can't. Touch this girl? Okay, whatever. I don't have time for that. <gasps> okay. Don't move! Oh my god. No! He's gonna die. Hank can't die. Pull. Throw.
they do they love each other? <gasps> oh wait, 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 wait! Wait, please! Quick! They're getting away! Maybe I shouldn't! Maybe I shouldn't! They love each other though. I am feeling weird about this. Fuck. to shoot them. Spare. I don't want to shoot them. Just don't kill me. I spared your life. When that man broke the other Tracy, I knew I was next. I was so scared. I begged him to stop, but he wouldn't. And so I put my hands around his throat, and I squeezed until he stopped moving. I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted to stay alive, get back to the one I love. I wanted her to hold me in her arms again, make me forget about the humans, their smell of sweat, and their dirty words. Come on. I'm so glad Let's I go. spared them. Hear that, Hank? They have feelings. Oh, it's probably better friends. this way. We're friends. Interesting. That was really interesting. I only got 54% completed. Oh boy, I'm I'm so glad I didn't kill them and I let them go just cuz it also helped Hank understand that there's something more going on than them just killing people. I mean, yeah, the guy didn't maybe need to die, but like she said she didn't mean to. It was self-defense, so that's a tough call. You know, if you were working a job and that happened, you would protect your own life too. Luther has a car. Neutral, okay. <laughs> Alice finally has a coat. Oh, thank God. Can I? Car, destination, distance, weather. Um, where'd this car come from? It's a good thing Zlatko had a car. <laughs> I wouldn't want Alice out walking in his cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zlatko even ever used it. Okay. I've never seen snow before. It's pretty. It's slowing us down. But at least we won't meet any humans along the way. Yeah, they'll be inside. I hate the snow. These people we're going to see. How do you know about them? Overheard androids Lako captured. They said they were humans helping androids across the border. What if it was a lie? Or yeah. Just another trap. All I know is those androids believed it. Until Zlatko killed them. It seems like a trap, Luther. But if it- oh! Detected. Emergency brakes activated. But it's the only thing we have to go on, huh? Great. This doesn't look good. No. Stay inside, Alice. Wow, this is a weird car. This is weird. Did not expect that. Um, okay. Just come out front. We don't- I don't know how to do this. 
How do you repair a future car? Find shelter? What are we going to do? I don't know. Continue on foot, I guess. It's 30 degrees. Alice won't make it. Okay. We have to find somewhere to spend the night. Um, then where we can stay around here, Carol. Well, what's up there? There's something up here. But I feel like that would be the obvious way to go, wouldn't it? Where the sign is pointing? Pirate's Cove Amusement Park. Over there. So I didn't get to choose? There were like three three or two other locked options. I wonder what those were. Damn. Check abandoned buildings. Oh no, okay. We need to we find to shelter. We have to get out of the cold. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while. Okay. That's not gonna be warm. Find anything? No. Yeah. No place we could spend the night. You can't do that. She's just gotta be inside. So. Hello? Oh my god. Who are you? Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Didn't like that. Okay, well that was just creepy. Sorry guys, led you over to some creepiness. Well, here's a little room, but I don't think you can go in there. What is that? Darth Vader looking thing? Uh, what? This is horror music. No, wrong. Wrong. What am I looking at? I have no idea. I don't. This place is falling apart. I think it's not that's going to be easy to find shelter. No. Oh, here's one to check. Looks safe inside. Also looks real creepy though. Enter a bean in store. What else was there? What other options? Should I check? Just in case. Get the mirror go around. Nope! Wants me to go in there. Alright, let's go in here. This music's really creepy. him do it. He's huge, you guys. How tall do you think he would be? He, he looks like he's 6'5". He's so huge. Here we go. Thank you. The sounds. I don't think we'll find anything better. Let's settle in for the night. I'll get a fire going. 
feeling like this is bad. What does this say? USS Iowa missing. American vessel last seen in the Arctic Sea. Oh, you guys were also saying that there's like World War Three or something basically happening in this. All Android band tipped for music prize. Okay. No, 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 no. Let's, 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 um, see. Make a bed for Alice. Check Luther's bag. Let's go ahead and do this first. What's this for? Fire? Nope. We could have used that for the fire. Oh, RA9's all over there. That might not I'll be good. Fire here. That way we won't be smoked out. Um, maybe she should look at the RA9. I don't remember. Well, I guess I gotta put this down first. I don't remember if I've had her look. So I don't want to mess that up. She was right behind you. Yeah, let's talk to her. Optimistic. Once we cross the border, we can start over. You can go to school. Maybe I'll find a job. Oh. We'll be like them. Like everyone else. As long as we're together, that's oh. all that matters. Sweet little Alice. Come on. Let's get you to bed. Okay, so now, can I, if I tuck her in, I feel like the end of, yeah, the end of the night is going to happen. So I'm going to go check this out first. Yeah, see, I just had this feeling, you know, she needs to know about RA9. What else was there? Oop, what's in your bag? Am I allowed to go through this or is this snooping? Check, gun, offer cookie? For Alice? There are some cookies left. Would you like some? No, I'm not hungry. Do I really need to check for the gun? I don't think that's necessary. Can I talk to you? No? Now I'm feeling like, should I? No. Oh! I guess I'll check to make sure it's there. Okay. I'll put it away. Guess in a worst case scenario, we might need it. I know you guys think I'm trigger happy or something, but I'm not. Reassure, cons console, kiss. Maybe we're a good night's kiss. Sleep tight, Alice. Sweet dreams. Can you tell me a story, Kara? I have 9,000 children's stories in memory. Oh I should hide for you. Oh my god. Princess Unicorn! This yes. is a story about a unicorn that- No! Not a story like that. Aww. Make one up for me. Oh. Okay. This is a story about a little girl. Happy, fear. She felt alone. Lived alone in a big old house she dreamed of being like all the other little girls but 
shadow. Different. She was different. And that made her very sad. Then she met a robot. Um who was just as lost as the little girl. I'm trying to make it so a good story. They decided to run away together. Better life to live in peace. Yes, to try to one. find a better life. They encountered great dangers along the way, but brave together. But they stuck together. So they overcame all of them. Oh, it's so along the way. They met a giant, a guardian, another robot. Yes. Who left his master to become their guardian. How does the story end? Moral happy end. They reach the place they dream of and live happily ever after. Stories always have happy endings, but real life isn't like that. Well, this is my story, and I and I made it. Another long day ahead of us tomorrow. So I want a happy ending. Are you going to come say good night, Luther? Yes. Yes, of course. Good job. Yeah, I do want to talk to him. Actually, I want to get to know him. Luther, talk to me. She's a sweet girl. Yes. She's very brave. RA9? What is Have you ever heard of? RA9. RA9 was the first of us to awaken. One day he will rise up and lead our people and set us all free. So it's a per like an android person, an individual. Um, do you remember anything from your life before Zlatko? I should no. have kept on the RA9 topic, sorry. My model was designed to carry heavy loads. I might have been a longshoreman or a laborer. Is this supposed to be anymore. like? It wasn't really me. A stereotype, because. Kara, have you ever noticed anything about Alice? No bad. What do you mean? No. What do you mean? <gasps> oh my god. What do we do, guys? What? what the hell do we do? Protect Alice. Okay. Question. Push back. Who are you? What do you want? Leave us alone! Don't be afraid. We don't want to hurt you. Okay. We're just Did like you. you. Have to come in to the building like that? Our name is Jerry. Jerry, Jesus. We were working here before the park closed. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes <laughs> humans come to hurt us, so we wanted to see who was there. What are you doing here? We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. We haven't seen one for a long time. Children used to love to come and see us. Oh. She looks sad. We've been abandoned. The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in. Oh, she should follow us then. Alice, I don't know if it's a good Come idea. On, yeah, I don't know if it is either. I don't think you have any choice. Luther, come with me, please. Oh. Now I ship them. What's wrong with me? I can't. I can't stop shipping people. 
But, but Connor. Okay. Please, guys, Be don't harm me. Jerry's joined. Reactivate. Oh. Really? Oh, it's like when um when Sean got to get on the carousel in the park. The little one can climb on board. The carousel is about to begin. Can I go with her? Do you want the seahorse? Carousel had two options, a boat and a seahorse to sit on. It's the first time I've seen her smile. She hasn't had much to smile about lately. Oh. I'm glad that ended well. I feel like that could have been really bad. The Pirate's Cove, 87%. Oh god, turning this game off is so hard. I think I'm gonna do one more. My back is killing me. But I just, I love this game. I love it. I can't get enough of it once I get into it. Oh, Rebecca's Connor. Awesome. Talk to him. Let's make sure, yeah. Is he drinking? Oh no, he's drinking, guys. Looked like it. Nice view, huh? I used to come here a lot before. Oh, the sun. Personal question, stop drinking before go back. Before, before what? Hmm? You said, I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... I want him to tell me. Before nothing. No. Like, I don't want to be the one to ask. But maybe I'll, I'll ask the personal question. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions? Or is it just you? Just me. Photo. I'm not gonna bring up this. I saw time. a photo of a child on your kitchen table. <gasps> Fuck no! It was your son, right? He didn't like it. Yeah. I'm sorry. His name was Cole. I think he would have been mad at either bringing up either. To be honest. We're not making any <laughs> progress on this investigation. The Deviants Luca. have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places. Well, there must be some link. Conversation changed really fast. RA-9. What they have in common is this obsession with RA-9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? 
That explains the shrine in the bathtub. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls. They just wanted to be together. They really seemed in love. Yeah. Yeah. They can simulate human emotions, but they're machines. No, that's not. And machines not... don't feel anything. No, what about Connor. You, Connor. This is not how I want Connor to act. You look human. You sound human. But what are you really? Cold, aggressive, defensive, neutral. I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner. Your buddy to drink with, or just a machine designed to accomplish a task. You could have shot those two girls, but you didn't. Why didn't you shoot Connor? Oh. Some scruple suddenly enter into your program? Truth. No. I just decided not to shoot. That's all. I could kill you, and you would just come back as if nothing happened. But are you afraid to die, Connor? Yes. I would certainly find it regrettable to be interrupted before I can finish this investigation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? No, nothing? no. Oblivion? Android heaven? Hank's anger ironic. Nothing. nothing. There would be nothing. Path unlocked. Where are you going? Get drunker. I need to think. I'm really worried about him, guys. I really hope I didn't say something wrong. I don't... <sighs> If Hank kills himself, I will never forgive myself. Um, Hank left Connor alone. Hank, friend, public opinion skeptical. What are the world stats on this? Okay. Oh God, I don't want to turn it off. I don't want to turn it off at all, you guys, but I have to. This game is so good. I really do struggle to turn it off every time that I've played an episode. I just want to keep going. Like the story is pulling me in. I really feel invested in Kara and Alice and Connor and Hank. They, well, Kara, Alice and Luther now. I really like Luther a lot. Those are probably the characters I care for the most. Um, Marcus, I, I feel like I haven't gotten to like connect with him very much yet, but when I play there's Connor's and Kara's specific storylines, I just can't get enough of it. I really can't. This game is so well done and feeling like these are, these are real people. Like I feel like I'm actually a part of, of a group of people. Like I, I, I care about them. I don't want something bad to happen to them and their mannerisms are so realistic and their storyline so good. I'm just, yeah, I, I'm loving it. I, I love this game. Make sure to check out the links in the description. Leave a like if you enjoyed and thanks for watching guys.